Hello my wonderful and amiable listeners. Welcome to another interesting news. The indigenous people of Biafra IPOP has described the renaming of the South Ni- Second Niger Bridge by the Southeast Governors after outgoing President Mohamed Buhari as a taboo in Biafra land. The indigenous people of Biafra affirmed that the leader after whom the bridge is named did not even show up for the opening ceremony after because he had no respect or regard for the indigo and knew that he did not deserve any accolades in Biafra land. The group in a statement signed by its spokesman, Imapa Fukuid, why the bridge was named after Muhammad Bari, who didn't initiate nor release any funding for the second Niger bridge project. The statement reads in part, the attention of the global family and movement of the indigenous people of Biafra, Ipo, under the leadership of Mazi Inamdi, Inamdi Okechuku Kano, has been drawn to the shameful meaning naming of the second Niger bridge after General Muhammad Bari by the shameless Igbo politicians. The man that the second Niger bridge is named after did not even show up for the opening ceremony because he had no respect or regard for Indigo and knows that he does not deserve any accolade in Biafra land. The sellout among the South Southeastern governors particularly APC governors, to want President Mama Dubari to become the face of the eastern region as they display the name and face at the entry and exit point of the southeast through the bridge. Mama Dubari was among these Nigerian genocidist soldiers who massacred Indigo at Asaba, Anambra, Enugu and in the rest of the eastern region. His government coordinated the influx of Fulani terrorists masquerading as headsmen who have massacred our people and raped our women. The lawless government of Muhammad Buhari went to Kenya and kidnapped an illustrious son of the Igbo land and the crown prince, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Mazi in Amdekanu, and renditioned him and refused to release him even after competent courts have ordered for his unconditional release. On what rationale was the second Niger bridge named after Muhammad Buhari? He didn't initiate nor release any funding for the second Niger bridge project. The Fulani stooge among the eastern governors and politicians should stop insulting our collective intelligence. The eastern governors and political leaders should know that they are holding their position in trust for the people and shouldn't see themselves as demigods. Others were there before them, and one day they would also vacate the position. Whatever good or bad they do as governors, we await them after the office. The current Eastern leaders have a choice to uphold the collective will of our people or please the caliphate at their own political and personal peril. The bridge should be named after Dr. Alex Ekweme, Chief Odemogu Ojuko, Dr. Sam Mbakwe. Professor Chinua Achebe, Kuluna Achueze, or many others that are well deserving Igbo indigenous that anyone can suggest. The name Muhammad Buhari is a taboo in Biafra land. If these traditional political leaders refuse to heed to our suggestion or of rena- renaming the Second Niger Bridge, we shall declare them enemies of the people. The indigenous people of Biafra affirmed that the leader after whom the bridge is named did not even show up for the opening ceremony because he had no respect or regard for Indigo and knew that he did not deserve any accolade from Biafra land. The second Niger bridge being this a Nigerian federal, cap- federal government project that is 1.6 km long and furnished with other alcinary infra- infrastructure, including a 10.3 km highway, a weary interchange, and a toll station, all at Ob- Obosi City, inaugurated in March 2022. It is open for local traffic in December 15, 2022. 
The project is being funded through the Presidential Infrastructure Development Fund created by President Mamadou Buhari and managed by the NSIA. The Presidential Infrastructure Development Fund is also used to fund the construction of Lagos Ibadan Expressway and the Abuja Kaduna Road. The second Niger Bridge crosses the Niger between the cities of Asaba, the capital of Delta State, which is rich in oil, in the west and Onitsha in the east. When completed, it, was, it will be the last bridge over the Niger River before it branches into its Delta arms. The Niger Bridge is the third longest river in Africa after Nile and the Congo. The second Niger Bridge, which has been used as the established term in Nigerian politics since the 1980s is misleading. In fact, there is already seven major bridges over the Niger in Nigeria alone, not to mention the countries in, Niger, in Niger or Benin. It is therefore correct to speak on the second Niger bridge at Onitsha. Taking Nigerians' opinion, Abdulaziz Mohammed said, It will be a taboo if any of you use the bridge. The bridge is called Mamadou Bari Bridge. If you don't like it, don't use the bridge. Blaze said, It is as simple as that. Don't use the bridge if you feel like the name Mamadou Bari is a taboo. He has named the bridge Mamadou Bari Bridge, and there is nothing the indigenous people of Biafra can do about it. Useless tribe. Seydou Kadiri said, We always dwell on meaningless something and corpse problem in there. If there's any income that is the name of the bridge, we generate Buhari or any person. The name General Muhammad Buhari will not gain any income. It is, it is just an honor done to him, probably because he was able to make sure the impossible since 1999 became possible. Ukuromo Joshua said, Nadi, I probably that construct them. If he did pay now, he should go to court. Samuel Samuel said, Don't mind those notices, governors. They should name Third Milan Bridge Ibrahim Babangida since Naim built them. Sunday Noah said, Maybe I service to win election again. Within I Sabi. Franklin Isa said, Because he built the bridge, why Igbos have many heroes abandoned? Buhari have not done any good to South East. No need for calling the bridge Buhari. Instead, name it in Namdekano Bridge. Ah. Eugenius Yunu said, It is not a taboo for him to construct the bridge, but naming him is a taboo <laughs> for any set of people. That will be all for now. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button. And let us know your opinion and your thoughts via the comment section below. Bye for now and I will see you on the next news.